everybody, welcome back to Taz's Wig Closet. This is Taz. Today we're going to do a sister style comparison and it's a true sister style comparison because they're very similar in style and they do have the same name. So we're going to compare Henry Margu's Kendall to the John Renault's Kendall. So if you like this kind of a video, be sure to go ahead and tap that like button, subscribe and leave a comment. that I'm going to show you today are both mid-length wavy styles, very popular styles in their class. So we're looking at the Henry Margu uh, Kendall in the color 614GR. Now 614GR is a beautiful blonde, the lightest blonde that Henry Margu currently has available in this color palette. You're going to see a light wheat blonde and then we have some pale gold highlighting on this one. And all of that is on a medium brown root. So the Henry Margu Kendall is going to feature a straight side bang here, about seven inches. So that's going to come down to the bottom of my chin because I'm seven inches from hairline to chin. Now I did measure it in the back from crown to the tip of the hair and it's 15 inches. And you'll see some variable lengths on the sides. Both of the Kendalls today will also feature a temple to temple lace front a fully hand-tied monofilament top, open wefted sides and back. They both weigh right around three and a half ounces. Henry Margu does an amazing lace front. I've never been disappointed with the Henry Margu quality in terms of their lace and their monofilament. And the monofilament part is visible anywhere you part it on the top. Henry Margu really did a nice job on this style. It's one of their most popular, and really I think it was their first one, their attempt at a beachy wave, and I think they really did nail it. Um, it's, a, it's not too choppy, it's not too soft and round. It's just right. Kind of an air dried look, but not too harsh. Let's go ahead and bring out our John Renault Kendall for comparison. Here I have the John Renault Kendall in the color Palm Springs Blonde, which is FS17101S18. Palm Springs Blonde is a part of the new John Renault Blondes collection. It's the ashiest blonde in the John Renault line. Palm Springs Blonde is a medium ash blonde base color with some white platinum highlights all over and a medium ash brown root. Uh, John Renault has an extensive color palette available on the Kendall. Actually, it offers four different gray shades. You will not find any gray shades available on the Henry Margu Kendall. So you're going to see right around 10 and a quarter inches on that front piece here on the John Renault Kendall. Uh, the length is exactly the same as the Henry Margu Kendall, about 15 inches from crown to tip. Now the layering is going to be a little bit different. You're going to find a little less obvious layering in the John Renault Kendall. It has more of a blunt cut um, on the bottom, less layering in the back than does the Henry Margu Kendall. In terms of the curl pattern, the John Renault Kendall has a nice tousled look to it. Um, however, it's a bit more rounded and blunt than the tapered textured layers here on the Beach Wave of the Henry Margu Kendall. So I went ahead and slipped on the John Renault Kendall to finish out this comparison. Right away you're going to notice a couple of things. The first one is that the front pieces here on the John Renault Kendall are much, much longer. So they're gonna stretch well be up below the chin on my face length. Also, uh, the John Renault Kendall seems to uh, frame the face a little more nicely. There's some contour and some curl around the face on those front pieces. Whereas on the Kendall uh, by Henry Margu, the front pieces seem to be a little more straight. The John Renault Kendall seems like it has a lot more density than that of the Henry Margu. And I think that's because of the layering on the Henry Margu. There's just a little more layering. There's a little more tapering. It just gives you a light, airy feel. Whereas with the John Renault, uh, you've got a little bit of a softer, more bluntly cut curl pattern at the bottom, which is going to lend you some more volume. 
John Renault's lace front is impeccably done as well. Both are very, very high quality caps. I have no complaints on either. So there's a lot of permatease on each of these styles. Uh, there's permatease all around the monofilament tops. You're going to find some at the back and at the nape and a little thicker here at the temple. The denier of the fibers is almost identical as well. I think they've both perfected the finer fibers on these styles. John Renault has a little more hair on their version of the Kindle. Let's talk price. So they're almost identical in retail price. Uh, just right over $300, between $300 and $350 for each one of these styles. And I hesitate to state an exact price. I'll leave the links below because as this video ages, the prices might change. A quick look at the caps for the Kindles. This one is the Henry Margot and this one is the John Renault. Both feature beautiful, well done lace fronts, full, very generous, single monofilament tops open wefted sides and back. Both feature velvet covered ear tabs. The Henry Margot features an open nape with Velcro adjusters. The John Renault features a closed velvet nape with Velcro adjusters. There seems to be a bit more wefting on the John Renault, which is consistent with the heavier density. Both are very stretchy and fit average right out of the box, although the Henry Margot seems to have more stretch and can, can accommodate a larger size than the John Renault. Thanks again for joining me today for this comparison of the sister styles Kendall and Kendall by John Renault and by Henry Margu. Next up, we'll do a side-by-side -side look at these two wigs so you can see some of those subtle differences. Everybody have a great day. See you next time on Taz's Wig Closet. Yeah.